In this video, we're going to be taking a look at Chihuahua or the Wawa token, the oldest meme coin on the Cosmos ecosystem or in the Cosmos ecosystem. So let's just hop right into this here. So Chihuahua has a Twitter, a website and everything else you would imagine. Uh, this, I can't believe this, but this is one of the only coins that I'm actually going to pull up DeFi Llama on. I know, I know, I know. All right, let's get, let's get to this. You guys don't want to waste your time. So decent. Uh, Twitter account here a lot going on got some good memes they're pretty active so um, I scoring pretty high there it's at Chihuahua chain on Twitter or X whatever you want to call it so the website I'll get into the charts in a minute here but their website is pretty decent too uh, you can figure out where to buy it you can get their socials all that good stuff you can explore what Chihuahua is and it's based on Cosmos, right? So you can stake it, you can vote when they have proposals um, for governance and then it's all, it's IBC enabled. So it's all over wherever you want to send it, whatever you want to do with it, send it to Osmosis, swap it out. Sure. Keep it on Osmosis, keep it on another chain. It's Cosmos, you can do that. It's, it's pretty crazy. So um, a lot of validators too, for it. Uh, big validators. So it was airdropped, oh gosh, 2022 at some point, I think to Atom Stakers. Um, let's look at, let's look at the FAQs real quick. So, and, and I guess there's NFTs coming. It's, it's, it's another one of those chains, kind of like, like Hava's doing. So if you guys want to read about it, you can here in their FAQ, how you, how you can get rewards for staking, how you can get involved, yada, 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 right? So here's a big one for me, the ecosystem. So they talk about dApps and all sorts of things, DeFi, which is wild for a meme coin, but hey, here we are. It's a new age of meme coins, even though it's like two years old or a year and a half old. Uh, relatively gone under the radar though, till, till recently, till uh, Cosmos really got popular last year. So they got a Chihuahua wallet, a Chihuahua verse, which is a metaverse type thing. Let's see what that is. Is it gonna be, on, it's on passage. Okay, so it's not out yet. Um, Eris protocol, yeah, great, okay. Wawa swap. It's not here yet. A lot of these are coming soon or whatever, but it is on White Whale. Yep. I'm, I'm sure you can trade it on White Whale. Uh, let's see here. What else? Secret Wrap, Pokachu. Yep. NFTs on Omniflix. Cool. All right. So DeFi Llama, like I said, right? And before we get in the charts, we're going, we're, we're doing this. All right, guys. 1.75 million TVL locked in this bad boy. Let's just zoom into where it matters, right? Boom. This is pretty much December last year. Look at this spike. Look at that spike. 8.3 million. 8x from what it is now. Eh, it's probably more of a 4, 4.5x from what it is now. So, whatever. I, <laughs> I've, never, I've never gone to DeFi Llama to look at this stuff, but you can actually see where it's sitting. Some of their TVL and whatnot. Um, I guess you can get Liquid Stake Chihuahua. All right, so let's look at the charts. Let's look at the good stuff here. So this is a yearly chart, one year chart on from coin market cap on Chihuahua or the Huawa token. Uh, we hit a high here. What's our high? Actually, we'll show it. Probably won't show it on this one. Um, I'll just do it the old fashioned way since I don't want to look. Yeah, 0 0.0006. We're sitting at 0 0.002 right now. So about 3x to get to where that high was, a little less actually. Two and a half, maybe. Um, so not too bad looking, really. I mean, if you zoom out, you're going to see this is barely a bump. So this thing was, what was the high on, on Huawa here? Uh, the high, all-time high, two years ago, January 20th, was 0 .0, 0 0.009. So that's a ways to go. I don't know if we'll get back there, but... I mean, if this thing gets to a half a penny, that'd be <laughs> insane. So the potential's there. I mean, this is easy to get to, very easy to get to, and it is still active. It's still got some volume. It's, it's mostly all on DEXs. It looks like MXC has it though. We can't get that in America, but, uh, well, I think actually you might be able to sneak into MXC. I can't remember, but it's difficult. Most people aren't gonna do it even if you can, but osmosis totally open to Americans. So that's where it's trading at here. So that's how we're going to access this thing. If you need, you're not going to need this probably for osmosis, but you can, you can get the contract address right here on the left as always. And if you couldn't figure out where those markets are, you just go up here to the top, 
right where it says chart, click to the right, markets, it takes you right down here. So, and if you need to know how to find this DEX, you're like, what's Osmosis? Click on it and it opens up the page right here to Osmosis and it'll send you to, actually it sends you to the pools, but that's okay. So I have Osmosis open. This is what the, the landing page looks like. Here's what the app looks like. It's just osmosis.zone. I'll link that below and I'll link how to uh, use Kepler wallet and all that stuff. So to trade this, I'm gonna be using Kepler wallet, but you can have any wallet that supports Cosmos chains. So um, I, I highly suggest Kepler. You can use Cosmos station, uh, whatever else. Leap wallet's pretty good too. But I'm gonna be using Kepler for this. It's what I have, it's what I've been using and it, it works pretty well for me. So sign into that, send some Atom or Osmosis. You can do either. Send that to, in fact, you know what? If you can get Osmosis, that'll be easier because you have to send your Atom to Osmosis, but it's honestly all pretty easy. So Atom or Osmosis, whatever you got, send it to your wallet, come here, and then we'll go through the steps. And actually I'll do it with Atom the harder way. So we'll go for that. All right, so hit approve since we're here. Now, this is Osmosis. It's, it's very clean, very easy to use. You could just swap right here, but I wanna get a little more Atom on since you guys might not have any. So you can come over to Assets. You can hit Deposit up here at the top left. And we're gonna deposit, if you had USDC or whatever you can, but you're gonna deposit some Atom. Next. And total of 7.4 Atom in my wallet. So I'm just gonna deposit um, I'll do 0.5. So deposit. Now this is going to send Adam from the Cosmos Hub to Osmosis. So I will still have it'll still show up as Adam, but it's going to be on the Osmosis chain. And this is an IBC transfer. It's very cool, very easy to do. One of the greatest things about the Cosmos ecosystem, if not the greatest thing. All right. Did our, there it goes, IBC transfer complete. So now, yep, I got 0.8 Atom instead of 0.3. And I wanna check my assets real quick again. So I've got some osmosis. You guys might need to get a little bit of osmosis here, but you don't have to. Uh, I use osmosis as a gas fee, it's the default gas fee, but I can show you how to not use it. Okay, let me get my camera out of the way for you guys here. So again, I just wanna go back to coin market cap real quick. Make sure you have this contract address copied. Just hit the two squares, it copies to clipboard. And then back here at osmosis. So we've got the 0.8 atom in the wallet and we now want that we're going to be trading for atom and we're going to be getting Huawa. So you could just type Huawa and Chihuahua shows up. So does Chihuahua with hat. However, to be certain you could paste that contract address you got from coin market cap and then Chihuahua shows up and it's the only option. So you can click that. So, okay. Let's say I want to trade 0.5 atom about $6 worth of Atom, okay? So a couple things now. There's this little gear icon, it's slippage. So slippage tolerance right here. We're, I'm gonna leave it at 0.5 and I'll tell you what that is. So slippage is the price when I hit swap, the price we're charged versus the quote we see right here. So if we're charged over 0.5%, it's gonna kick this order back, reject it and say, nope, you're charging too much. And then at that point we can either try again or set the, set the slippage up higher. Now I mentioned gas fees. You can pay gas fees in osmosis like I usually do, or you can pay them in Atom. And to do that, you come down here to where it says one Atom equals however many Huaba right above swap. You hit that little down arrow to expand this box and then you're gonna see everything here, right? So how much are we gonna need? Network fee, so it's not gonna be much. Okay, so let's see the route taken here too, if you want. Okay, cool. All right, so hit swap, and then we're gonna change to, we're gonna change right here in your wallet. If you guys didn't see that, you hit right here where the transaction fee is. We're gonna change this 0.1, or this one penny to Adam right here. So there you go. Now you could pay an Adam if you wanted. However, I suggest just throwing some osmosis down and making it easy. Okay, so. You could now hit approve. Transaction will go through and it's successful. So I'm gonna open up my wallet. We're gonna see if we, oh, nope, actually I'm gonna go to assets, I forgot, because this is, we're still, everything's still on osmosis. 
So you're actually going to go to withdraw over here on Chihuahua. You're going to click on the number right here. It, it looks like it's grayed out, but it's not. Click on it. So you're going to send all that out. Just withdraw. Oops. I, this is going to pop up requesting access to Chihuahua uh, connection to it. So hit approve. Now you're going to hit withdraw because everything's lit up now. I, I didn't realize this wasn't connected already and it wouldn't be for you guys. So you'll have to do that. Hit approve. This is an IBC transfer. It's sending Chihuahua off of osmosis to the Chihuahua network. And these are usually very, very quick. So there it is. We can see there's no Chihuahua left. And now I'm going to open up my wallet and actually I'll turn my camera off again so you guys can see. Open up my wallet and we'll wait for that Chihuahua to show up. Sometimes it does take a second. There it is, one new token found. Chihuahua, add chain. Look at that, $6 of Chihuahua. We are living large with Chihuahua. Okay, so there actually is one other way and I'll show you guys that too right now. That's gonna be, if you have Kepler wallet, this is pretty neat and some a lot of wallets will do this, but Kepler is, is uh, my favorite at this. So you can just go right here to the swap and you can say, hey, I'd like to trade another 0.5 atom. And this is actually on the Cosmos hub. We're not sending it to Osmosis at this point. It is using Osmosis, but we're not sending it to it. And I'd like to get Huawa. And if Huawa wasn't there, you could just type Huawa, right? And there it is. So, and there's a bunch of fake Huawa stuff there. So be careful. However, you could just do that. Adam to Chihuahua. Transaction fee is a little bit higher. It's four cents. That's okay. Let's go ahead. All right. Maybe it's only a penny higher. I'm not sure. Anyway, hit next. It's going to do an IBC transfer. And you're going to wait. It's not very long. I don't think it's going to be two minutes. Transaction success. Okay. Our swap was successful. Everything went through. Utilizing osmosis here. Just kind of a shortcut to it if you use the wallet. I still like to go to osmosis for some reason. And there you have it, $12. So it doubled how much Chihuahua we have. So it's that simple, guys. If you have Kepler wallet, you can just do it this way. All right, so that's all there is to it. You got two ways that you can buy your Huawa now, and that's it for the video. So if you guys could hit the thumbs up button down below, like and subscribe, I'd appreciate it. It helps out a lot. We'll see you in the next one.